What about your cancer, Brother Tommy? You want me to go? <laughs> Come on. Go ahead. Well, uh, I've had a short bout, I guess short bout with cancer mm -hmm. compared to others. You know, mm -hmm. they had it for years. But uh, December 23rd of this past year, um, I got a phone call. I went and had a test done. Got a phone call, and, and, and the doctor was on the other end, and he goes through all this doctor stuff. Mm -hmm. Right. Finally, there at the end, I think, well, I need to make sure. I said, so you're telling me I got cancer? He said, yeah. Mm. So anyway, he set me up with another doctor, and it was a month or so, and uh, didn't know if it had spread or not. Um, they'd have to do a surgery. They said they'd do surgery to go in there and, and uh, remove it and uh, do some other stuff and test it and so on and so on. But anyway, in December, um, leading up to this surgery, which was scheduled for February 5th, you know, me not knowing, Haley not knowing, you know, the extent of this thing, really. And mm -hmm. I, I know some people here and, uh, you know, watching have uh, received that phone call or whatever that says you got cancer. And, you, right. and our human side, we just automatically go to the dark side. Mm -hmm. Right. You know, right. Right. Because that's where we, we program. Yes, this is things we see in life. And, the big C word. And, yeah. Right. Leaves, it brings up a lot of questions. But it took about a couple of weeks to kind of absorb this thing and let it settle in. But anyway, in December, we had, uh, and I, I give God all the glory for this, 21 days of fasting and prayer. Yep, yes, sir. And at 6 o'clock every morning, we'd meet here and pray. There was a group here that met here Amen. and pray. Yeah. And there was one morning, we stood right here. And that group of 10 or 12 folks anointed yep. me with oil and prayed over me. Amen. Healing. Amen. Yeah. They didn't pray the doctors and Come all on. this stuff go well. Right. They claimed healing yes, sir. over me that day. Yes, sir. And that day I walked out not, not, I, I knew I would be here. Yeah. Right. But I didn't know what was coming later on. Yeah, but anyway, right. anyway, they did the surgery, and uh, this doctor, he's a man, a few words after the surgery. Well, we got it all, you know. Yeah. It's okay. I'm good with that. So, yeah, yeah. Anyway, they uh, sent me to another doctor when he was through. I guess you get cancer. I don't know if you ever get released from a doctor or not. But anyway, he passed me on to another doctor, and right. I went to see him and gave him the report from what this other doc did. And he's saying, this is strange. Amen. The way he's talking about it. He Amen. Said, he said, there's nothing here. And I said, what? Right. So he kind of showed me, yeah, they took out four different areas. He said, there's no cancer. There's yeah, no amen. cancer. Mm -hmm. So me being an old country boy, pretty simple, I'm thinking, you mean to tell me? <laughs> you did all that and there was nothing there? Right. And he said, no, you had cancer. Yes, sir. But whenever they took it out, I mean, they had to, they had to take it out to do right. the testing. So let me ask you this. How much, how much chemo and how much radiation do you have? None. Come on. No, I'm talking about. <laughs> I mean, I went to this other doctor. He did send me to do another test because mm -hmm. there was a couple of other mm -hmm. things, and there was nothing there. Nothing. Amen. He said, "Well, there's nothing else for me to do." That's right. <laughs> but uh, you know, that one doc says, "I don't understand." I said, "Well, I understand." Amen. Come on. Amen. That's right. Amen. Uh, Amen. Absolutely. You Amen. Know, zero him, treatments. Zero treatments. Nothing. I'm cancer free. And so, I remember the day you got that news. I, we we talked out there yeah. in the parking lot, and and you were a little perturbed. You got cut on for nothing. <laughs> well, uh, so. you know, that's what comes to your mind. You think, right. what? I said, but right. now there is absolute oh. evidence of a miracle. Right. Yeah, that's you evidence. Know. And 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 they tried to explain it away. The doctor yeah. tried yeah. to explain it away, but it didn't work with me. I knew. Yeah, he said you did have cancer, but then when we went in there and. It you was, don't have cancer. There was right. nothing there. Well, we know what happened between the two. That's right. Bruce, Bruce